Most people in America are familiar with how much money they have in their pockets when they lay themselves down to sleep. Of late, I'm a man who has been fortunate enough to receive a gift card to a store in which I shop almost every day, multiple times a day, when I need my food and my intake to appropriately match my cellular health. I've been really fortunate that a woman who is related to the Force Network provided me that. The sad thing is she didn't realize that I already knew that, and it was prophetically given to me. I also am usually aware of when people are not properly here for me. There are a lot of people in America who like to abuse people in the name of their version of God. What I can tell you is that Jesus Christ never asked you to do that, and God himself finds it odd. The reality of the Lord's house is that people are dying today, and people have always been dying every day. Across the history and heritage of America, we have faced many epidemics, many pandemics, many diseases, many accidental deaths, and many things that have been murderous in God's house. God is displeased with America is absolute truth. God is marveled by the rest of the world is probably also true. There are many people like me who have a different faith than you, but yet we violate nobody's faith. If you tell me you're a Christian, I say, good for you. If you tell me you're Wiccan, I say, great for you. If you tell me you're some sort of faith that's Muslim, I say, well, good luck to you, because most of us don't like it, and Jesus Christ is not pleased with it. You have aided and abetted so many rapes, so many murders, and so many illnesses in your country that God is not pleased with you. Now, I can say that as a prophetic person, I can render that as an opinion who reads the news, and I can tell you that pleased people do not abuse other people. They do not pretend to be people that they are not. They do not try to do things that are immoral. We have a lot of people that are abusing a person's, a photographer's copywritten work by, for example, using some famous person's photograph as their avatar on their social media. It's inappropriate. We have a lot of people committing identity theft, pretending to be famous people by creating a social media account as those people. It's not okay to do that. Openly, it's a violation of that famous person's rights. And what I can tell you about immorality today is that people are really out of houses, God, out of God's house today. People are not flocking to churches, and that's the pastor's fault to a point, but it is also the fault of the ministers who are supposed to be preaching and teaching the word of the Lord. The word of the Lord is about love, loyalty, honor, and peace. Any quote-unquote self-proclaiming house of God that teaches hatred, bigotry, discrimination, or the righteousness of abusing people like me will not be going to the house of the Lord.